Yo, what up? This is your boy Burnell with some more creative success. I was just talking to my homie who's super good at marketing and branding, and we were talking about ways to stand out in 2018, how to really get your music out there and rise above the noise with consumer behavior changing with the music industry overgoing a radical transformation over the last couple of years. People are consuming content different than ever. And uh, I was we were having this conversation and then I happened to be listening to this podcast earlier and I was listening to Les Brown, the OG, and he was saying, never tell a story without making a point and never try to make a point without telling a story. So I really think we all need to focus on storytelling and documenting rather than just releasing songs. I think every song that we release should have like a whole story behind it. Every song that you make shouldn't just be a link on SoundCloud. It should be a video of you in the studio recording it. It should be a video of you talking about the lyrics and what, and what the song actually means. Um, tell a story behind the song such and such happened in my life and I was going through this and I met this girl and then we ended up moving to California and this has happened and then I saw I went to this restaurant and outside of this restaurant there was a a starfish and that's where my new song starfish like that's where I got the inspiration and here's the whole story behind it you know like tell a compelling story like that and paint a picture for people rather than just releasing songs so that's what I'm gonna start doing I'm gonna start like documenting things more um, telling stories more rather than just like putting out content or like putting out music put out a lot more content around the music you know what I'm saying because at the end of the day people are really inspired by personalities and actual like authenticity more than just dope music like a lot of people can make dope music but if you're a dope person and they like your vibe they're gonna like you so much more and they're gonna gravitate towards your personality and that's what they're gonna latch on to rather than just your dope bars or your fresh beats or whatever you might have. Uh, I think telling stories is just like the number one way to really stand out in 2018. And I think just the more content you release, the better. I've personally been putting out way more stuff than usual. And I've seen my numbers just exploding on all platforms because of that. So um, the world is just moving fast. There's a lot of people putting out a lot of great content. So you are just going to get buried and no one's going to ever see you unless you're just consistent with it, putting out stuff every day. Like My goal is to not go a single day without putting out something, whether it's a beat, a song, a video, an email, a really dope post, you know, whatever it might be. And just trying to take people on my journey and show people who I am. So um, that's kind of what we were talking about. And I think all artists and a lot of people in general can just kind of take some good insight from that of just be, telling stories more rather than trying to make yourself look cool or popular or whatever just tell a story like here's me I'm on the rise trying to be a rapper and here's me recording in my bedroom or whatever you might do just tell stories about it and put out as much content as possible I'm talking everyday songs videos blog posts vlogs social media posts and then you can repurpose all your content too like you don't have to go crazy making content all day every day you can take you can record all your snapchats uh, and then be killing it on snapchat and then download your entire snapchat story and put that on YouTube and that could be like a vlog you know what I'm saying you could do that every week or every day if you want the same thing you could do with Instagram stories you can take all your music videos chop up a little piece of it and then a 30 second clip of you talking about it and put that on Instagram um, you can just repurpose and chop different pieces of your content and mix and match them across different platforms and add to them in different ways you know like I'm about to start putting the audio from these videos so I'm making these videos for YouTube right but then I take the audio from these and I'm gonna put them over some of my beats and stuff of like some of the best things I say and I'm gonna put those on Spotify and um, Google Play and iTunes and all that and so I'm like repurposing the content from this video in a whole new way that'll engage people in a different way just more chances for more people to hear you the more shit you're putting out on all different platforms consistency pays off that's my insight and just kind of what was on my mind for today so hope you guys can take some good tips from that and if you have any uh, 
other cool ideas leave those in the comment below because I'm a student just as much as I am a teacher. If I'm actually, I'm more than a student than a teacher, that's for sure, actually. <laughs> and I want to learn as much as I can from you guys. So, um, if you got any tips on how you're going to stand out in 2018, or some like ideas that you have of what you're going to do to really get your shit out there in this new world, leave them in a the comment below and I'll make sure to reply to everybody. And if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe to my channel. I'm putting out stuff every day, so. Mad love and respect. I'll see you guys tomorrow.